Hey, it's Jabo. Welcome to Rigazar, your home for Lego hauls. In this video, we got a couple of packages. I got one from Kill Jones. I got one from a Brickling Quarter from Germany, and a couple other things. First of all, I want to say I wish Walmart had had the uh, the Galaxy Explorer available in my area. I know a lot of people have been able to get the Galaxy Explorer for seventy-five dollars, and I keep going to the website and checking. They never have it. <laughs> It's always sold out, and I can't get it, while other people are still able to buy it and get it for $75. I didn't get that, but I did place another order. And this, I placed this order around midnight last night, and by 9 o'clock in the morning, it was on my porch. So, uh, one thing Walmart has is fast shipping. So, yeah, I placed it at midnight, and then I woke up, and basically this was on my porch. So I bought the aquarium. It was $22, which was like over 30, I think it was 30% off. I want to say so um uh yeah i had to get the aquarium i didn't have to get it but that's the only thing i could find i'm so disappointed there's one other thing i bought it hadn't come yet uh, but uh one other thing i want to show you i got this from amazon in this very secure packaging here it is this and this so instead of buying the series Filling the packs and getting the Series 23 minifigure that I want. I just bought these and I'm going to hoping, I am hoping that the one minifigure I want is in one of these two boxes. I'm not going to do that in this video though. Now let's get to the other stuff. I got this package from uh, Mr. Kiel Jones. I always get his name wrong. It could be Kyle. But, um, here we go. Let's open this up. See what's in here. Oh my. <laughs> Hold on a minute. He says. <laughs> this is what happens when you make a video showing your BrickLink wanted list. And that was only showing what was in somebody's store in my wanted list. So. Uh, he sent me the R2-D2, <laughs> which is on my... I need to take it off of my wanted list. So, I have some Lego Star Wars sets that I've been piecing together. Things that either I built, or my son built, or friends of ours built, or my son-in-law built. I mean, it's tons of them. And pieces have gotten missing. The cats knock stuff off. Minifigures are missing. And some of my X-Wing fighters and other things... Um, were missing minifigures, and one of them was this um, R2-D2. <laughs> and so now it's not missing. So I gotta, you know, what I really gotta do is find the Star Wars set that this went to and put it with it and take it off of my wallet, <laughs> which I am terrible at doing. <laughs> so that's pretty funny. <laughs> and it, and I did say in the video that I have things on my wanted list that are actually in the basement. I just don't know where they are. So I got to make sure I don't lose this one since he was kind enough uh, to send it to me. <laughs> All right. So this next package is going to be different. Uh, uh, you know, you know, whatever, you know, what's in every package I get from Europe is tipper truck parts, boat weights, and blue track. Oh, well, maybe it's not going to be so different. <laughs> oh my goodness. <laughs> oh, it's gonna be a little different. I think I'm I think I'm acquiring one of the largest collections of blue track in the United States of America. So this is uh, a blue track. We've got some of the conducting rails in there as well and a crossing. I need to get all that stuff sorted. We also got Nine volt track and tipper truck parts. So we got, oh, I thought it was a broken tipper truck, but it's not, it's a Fabuland part. And the rest of this, it looks like it's pretty much Fabuland part. So I went there for the tippers and I came away with all this Fabuland stuff. So I went ahead and bought a bunch of the car bases just in case I'm trying to piece together because there are some smaller sets that I may not have. But at any rate, getting oh, I just sounded like brick trains just then. Getting different bases, look like they make different um, sizes there. 
You got the small red and the large red, like that. Then we got other parts. I think that's for the airplane. That's a door, that's a chair. That's the side of a building, I guess. You got some that have stickers on them, so you'd have to figure out what set that was. I'm pretty sure it said in his listing. Oh, the bay window, that's always a nice one to get. More airplane parts. This is part of the airplane. I got enough to make the airplane set now, I think, I think, I think. <laughs> I think those some of the main parts for one of the airplane sets. Oh, look, and a 4x10 thing. A bed. And some Golden Baron. I can't eat that <laughs> because of uh, my teeth. You know what? This video is kind of short. I think I will look at my my mini figure. So it was a little different. I mean, I had Fabuland parts, and there wasn't just all blue rails and tipper truck parts and no boat weight. So a little bit different. So let's see if I can get... The figure that I want. I only want one. Well, I take it back. I want two, maybe two figures from this series. Everything else I don't care about. So if ever there was a, a collectible minifigure series that I should be filling the packs, it's this one. But I don't like filling the packs. So we're going to do this the hard way. I'm only going to build it if it's one I want to keep. Oh, look, they're still not doing paper. All right, so that is clearly going to be the turkey turkey suit guy yeah so we got turkey suit guy we got ah this is the oh we're, in, we're okay this is definitely one of the ones it's not the one i wanted but it is definitely a keeper it's the dragon guy he's ready to go to dragon con because he's the dragon guy Let's see if I can build them. How does this go? I bet his tail goes there. His body goes there. His wings. Whoops. His wings. Did they go in the front or the back? They go in the back, right? I just lost his head. Where's his head? Or is it a girl? It's not a dragon guy. It's a dragon girl. Oh. I'm going to put this thing on here. And... I don't know where the horns are supposed to go. They go there. Oh, dang it. These things are hard to pick up. Now I gotta look at the picture to see if I built it right. Second one, one of the ones I wanted. And I knew that usually when there's the teeth, there's always an extra one. So I did see the extra one there. All right, so we are doing good. We are doing good. Um, all right, let's see if this one is one I want. It is not. That is the blue one, which is another robot. It's a robot. Is it a girl or a guy? I don't even know. I never really liked the robot figures from the uh, CMF series. The next one is Mr. Titanic. So, uh, not a woner, but definitely something you can do a, um, a float test with. So... I guess it's a keeper in that regard. Man, this has got to be the biggest leg accessory piece ever here for this boat. <laughs> then give three cheers and... Th wait, 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 wait. Is it? Give one cheer and three cheers more for the hardy captain of the pinafore. Something like that. How, how does that song go? And what is this piece? Oh, this is a little smokestacks. <laughs> so he gets an extra smokestack. Shake that bubble butt. This is terrible. Yeah. HMS Titanic. Did I just do it backwards? I think I did it backwards. Which side's the front? Which side's the back? I am not knowing. I think that is the front. That is the front and that's the back, I think. Yeah, because there's the rudder in the back. All right, so I, I'm okay with those two figures. Got two more to go in this pack. And we got the snowman guy. And one more to go. Oh, I'm going to be so disappointed. I have to open that other box. The next one is... Um, the elf girl yeah elf girl dang it 
Dang it, I don't want to have to open this. All right, let's go to the next one. I'm going to be, you know what, if I see any one of these six figures in, in the first one that I open, I'm going to be really, really, really disappointed. <laughs> so here we go. Let's, let's see, is it going to be one of the other six? It is, it is, it is, or isn't? What is this? Oh, it's the wolf guy, so that's, that's not one I had before. All right, and it was a wolf, was there a wolf guy? Yeah. Little Red Riding Hood. We got, this is it, this is it. Ah, wonderful. Oh, wait, wait. No, it is, why has he got a horse? Oh, I see. Oh my goodness, look at, this one has a ton of accessories. All right, he got short legs. Why has he got short legs? Man, so it's got the classic castle kind of logo there. Um, so we're going to cover that up with this, which is again the classic Yellow Castle style logo. Is this a girl? It's a girl. It's a girl. All right, and she's got a helmet. Got this style of the original Yellow Castle, except it's not going to break. And pink flowers. I mean, not fl flowers, feathers. <laughs> pink feathers she's got golden swords she's got the shield she's got more accessories than she can hold she's got the shield like the original yellow castle and she's got her horsey oh my goodness she's got she can't hold all this stuff <laughs> there's you don't have enough hands she needed a third hand so this might be the most overloaded um, minifigure in CMF history other than um, Gonzo. I mean, look at all the stuff she's got. She can't even ride her horse. That is sad. Let's see if she can hold it. Is there any way we can make it where she can hold the horse? There we go. Whoops. Maybe not. We'll try. That is what I wanted. Very good. So we got two figures that we wanted. One that I'm happy to keep. And we'll just see if we have a complete set now. Might as well. I'm sorry I'm not building them. I'm just not... I'm not that much into CMFs anymore. All right, so we got... Uh-oh. That one is the deer. And I just lost part of that one. And... I can't open this one. Why is this one not opening? Let's try another one. We got this one. It is the popcorn guy. We got this one. It is the pink fairy girl. And this one that doesn't want to open has got to be the, the soldier guy. It is. So we have a complete set. <laughs> it's the soldier guy. Awesome. Isn't that the best unboxing ever? So the buying the um, two boxes really worked out this time. I got a complete set. Don't have to buy these figures ever again. And um, yeah, those are the three main ones that I'll keep out of these. Pretty cool. All right. Thanks for watching this haul. Thank you for ones that have uh, joined as members. Uh, if you want to be a member to the Brickzar family, it's a way of supporting the channel, getting early access to videos. A full level gets occasional special video just for you. And we do live streams for the Zar level. And we really appreciate all the help because I need it because I stink at this. Anyway, thank you for coming along on the journey. Thanks, Kill, for the, <laughs> the R2-D2. <laughs> and uh, we'll see you guys in the next video.